Hi class, today we're going to use CodePen to explore JavaScript. The first thing we need to do is go to CodePen.io and then click sign up. You can sign up with email, you can create a free account, and then once you've done that, you can create your first pen to start coding. When you create a new code pen, it gives you three panels to write web code. We have our HTML panel, our CSS panel, and our JavaScript panel. If we write HTML, it'll be rendered in the preview space below. Today, we're going to be using CodePen to explore JavaScript. So we're going to mostly just use this JavaScript panel. Let's start by renaming our CodePen. Once we do that, we want to save it. And now let's rearrange the workspace. If we click on this little button filled with squares in the top, we can change our view. Let's choose a stacked view. Because we're just writing JavaScript, we can grab this panel and drag it all the way up so that our JavaScript panel is the biggest one on the page. Next, we want to open up the console in the console, we can see the output of our JavaScript program. Now that we've done that, we can press save. One issue we're going to have with CodePen is as we start to type code, CodePen is going to report errors. What's happening here is that uh, CodePen is trying to auto preview our code before we've actually finished typing it. So it's throwing an error. It's always good to see errors in programming because it helps us catch our mistakes. But this isn't really an error. It's just that CodePen's trying to show us our code before we're done typing it. Um, we're going to turn this feature off. If you go into settings, there's uh, a tab called behavior and we can turn off this auto updating preview feature. Press save and close. And now we can clear our error by typing the clear button right here above the console. We should get rid of it. Okay, so our first program is going to be a hello world program. What this is going to do is print out the words hello world in our console. So to do that, we're going to type console.log with parentheses. This is a built-in method in JavaScript. And what it does is it takes an argument and then it prints it out over here in the console. If I do double quotes and I write hello world uh, with a semicolon at the end, I've written my first JavaScript program. To run it, we're going to press the run button up here. We can see CodePen just built the preview and now we see hello world in the console. That's it, that's your first program, hello world. Okay, make sure you save your work and check out the next video to see what's next.